introduce James Hall for an yes, ADE sir. special. It's coming in live streaming and we caught up with this busy man. He's been doing radio shows. He's got a radio station, My House Radio FM, which I am proud to say I have a simulcasted show each and every week on Fridays, which has been doing quite well. And I was told they are the number one radio station on the internet in the world. And there's only one world, Earth, <laughs> Earth, Earth, USA, Europe, UK, continents, whatever. He is number one. He puts all his energies, heart and soul into the radio. And he was asked in the ADE committed community, or should, I, or should I say, the ADE guys are putting together live streams to come and do a live stream performance, plus talk a little about, you know, his background. So, James, thanks for catching up thank with you. us. Your hey, hard man. Thank you, Liddy. <laughs> so <laughs> what people at ADE want to know is what does ADE mean for you and all the DJs that would go each and every year? You know, ADE to me is very important. It's a, it's, it's more than just a place to come play. It's a place for everybody to come network and socialize and put faces to names, you know, almost like, you know, when we were down in Miami, you know, and you go down and do the winter music conference, but you know, the ADE is more on a grander scale, I think, because you get a, such a worldwide audience, you know, there at the ADE and, 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 and Amsterdam in itself, man, is just a great place to have it. I, I absolutely love it. Of course, besides, you know, everybody knows about all those smoke shops, you know, <laughs> yeah, yeah. and having a little tea and coffee and having little croissants. Yeah, out and, and, you know, hanging with Buddha last year. <laughs> well, here's a question now. Does ADE bring you chances when you go, when you always gone? I mean. Yeah, it absolutely in, does. In a sense of new work experiences, possible gigs, you know, can yeah. you share that? You know? One of the things is, you know, along with the, the radio station is that, you know, we have about 48 DJs from around the world on the radio station. And through the DJs there, I was asked last year to come to the ADEs. And when I came to the ADE, I met um, a young lady by the name of Monica Kiss. And Monica Kiss is a progressive house singer, totally out of my realm, you know, but we sat down, we talked. And when I was talking to her and played there at the ADE, she liked my style and everything. So Monica's asked me to come down to the Winter Music Conference already. She um, wants me to come over there to Croatia. And through the contacts, through her, I met a guy, um, Massimo Garini, from Switzerland. And so I'll be playing over there in St. Moritz at a ski resort here at, uh, after the first of the year. I'll be headed out there and uh, the guys want me to also come over to Italy. So, I mean, when it comes to chances, I mean, it doesn't get much better than that. Lee. God bless. Isn't that a wonderful thing? Yeah. Even Sylvian. Sylvian, I met last year through those guys. And next thing you know, you know, Sylvian's on a radio station and now we're here. You know, it's a great thing. That's awesome. So, so, you know, they were asking me, what are you doing music wise? Are you, are you stepping into production or are you just running the radio? And well, so this year I was fortunate enough to go in and uh, do a nice remix for uh, K Ture. It's called uh, cause I love. And that track just really went up. I was I think all the way up to number 20 on track source this year. And that was pretty great, you know, considering that, you know, that was my first full scale production you know i'd always done you know a couple you know sample remixes here and there but that was it was awesome doing that and so now we're working on a couple other tracks i'm working with uh buddha morales and working with him and mercedes the kids you know to do some things and then i'm going to do another track with k terry and then i'm going to do another one with uh massimo greeny over there more of on the techie side and so yeah i was kind of trying to do my thing man with running this radio station as you can imagine with 48 different people is just um, work in itself. Oh yeah, yeah. It, always, it always is. I mean, um, especially when it's a labor of love at first because it just, you know, you're just working at and hoping this thing can even get off the ground. And then when it becomes a business and 48 DJs trying to get everybody placed on the right times, it's trying. Yeah, it's it is. Making sure their sets are in, making sure everything is, you know, running smooth, you know? 
a lot of people, they, they like to listen to the radio station. They don't understand the work that goes behind it and all the networking and all the socializing here on, you know, platforms like uh, Facebook and Twitter and Instagram. And so you're, you're, you're constantly in um, networking mode, so to say. So now as we are in an election year in the United States <laughs> <laughs> and the stress of the election year and also the coronavirus of COVID-19, how yeah. are you coping with the COVID and everything? I'm coping well, you know, and uh, as you can imagine, nobody can go to the club, you know, clubs are shut down everywhere. And, but yet you have such a big fan base for this music. What better, you know, to have than a radio station that provides everything that they're looking for, you know? So yeah, I'm coping, I'm coping pretty good right now. My numbers are up, people are happy. Can't go wrong, you man. Can ask for. That's all you can ask for. <laughs> you know, you can't, you can't ask for anything better than that. <laughs> better than you that. know, and really most important part is COVID ends. Everything yes. is fine. What's the plan? COVID ends. Everything is fine. More networking, more getting out to the public, trying to deliver. Um, we're trying to, we're going to start a label here from my house radio. And so um, hopefully we can get, you know, with all these producers and, with all the, you know, the talent that we have here on the radio station, why not pull it together, you know, and try to put it out there, you know, to the people, you know, we got the, you know, we've got almost what 18 million uh, followers, man, for my house radio. And so what bigger base to, you know, to get it out there, you know? Wow. That's pretty awesome, bro. Yeah. It's a lot of people following <laughs> and listening. A lot of people. Are you starting hey. to put commercials on on the radio yet? Are you putting? Are you no, you know what? It, it's, a, it's a crazy thing. And, you know, everything is put out by myself and um, Glenn Williams, who's my partner. And we, we come out of pocket with all this because we want to keep the station underground. We don't want commercial influence. People love the music. We want to deliver music. A bunch of people I found, you know, people don't like coming to a radio station and listening to the commercials because when the commercials go on, what happens? They usually turn off, you know? And so if we keep the music and keep the jams rolling, they're gonna stay and they're gonna listen. So like I said, you know, so right now we're coming out of pocket for this, you know, we get donations and things like that from people. And that's all we're doing. I'm not in this for the money. I'm in this for the love of house. All right. Well, that's what <laughs> said. That's said by a, a big player in the game. <laughs> James Hall is in it for the love of house music. Absolutely, my brother. Is there anything you want anybody to know? Any up to upcoming stuff besides all the hard work you're putting with the radio? Leave the you know, people hungry for more. Yeah, man. You know, like I said, you know, we got myhouseradio.fm. Just tune in. Like I said, we have 48 DJs from around the world, man. What better smorgasbord of music can you think of that? You know, that that's just just everything right there for the taking, you know, we got a nice chat room on the site where, you know, people are networking and going crazy, you know, every day, you know, that place is loaded, you know, and Hey, I'm happy if they're happy. So on that note, AD is happy and AD thanks you for taking the time at your busy schedule. Cause this is one of the first ones we're doing a virtual one. It's a little mm -hmm. strange for everybody, but we will get through this. And we shall prevail. James Absolutely. Hall, we know we'll enjoy your set. Thank you so much. <laughs>
talking about back when I started.
music, you have good and bad. And a lot of people are taking the time to bring out all the bad. It's an example of disco. taking the time to bring out all of the bad. Right. Uh, it's an example of disco. And uh, we want the raw DJ to mix this album just like if he was at the studio and we pick the song. taking the time to bring out all of the bad. Right. Uh, it's an example of disco. And uh, we wanted our DJ mix this album just like if he was at the studio and we picked the song. Just like any new form of music, you have good and bad. And a lot of people are taking the time to bring out all of the bad. Right. Uh,
Body like vote, should you do?
Just trying to freak her, you will gotta eat her.
west side. The white beach for my 40 and I turn it up. Designated driver, take the keys to my truck. Hit the shawl, cause I'm baiting. Honey's in the streets, say money, yo, we made it. It feels so good in my hood tonight. The summertime skirts and the guys ain't canine.
Yeah. 